Folks, welcome to episode 64 of Trails in the Sky the Third. I'm Mike, and last time we have defeated the three other last bosses. And now we have the main final boss with the main party. The one who pretended to be Rufina. It's got giant arms. Giant everything. Of course, we're gonna go cosmic for the final battle. It's got wings. It's got a rotator thing. And it's gonna lose. Alright. Kick things off. Huh. Is there only one target? Okay, guess there's only one target. Let's do it. Eat it all up. We're gonna start with our 200 CP S craft barrage. Really good damage, that's five digits. Alright, Reese, your turn. Hopefully, you're also gonna do five digits. We're gonna watch all the first, the animation of, of the S-Craft for the first time we execute it in this episode. It's a final battle. It's, we, this might be the last time we get to enjoy these long animations. Alright, knock their socks off. Okay, not quite five digits, but it'll do, I guess. Your turn, Estelle. The true Wheel of Time. I think I've seen this. I probably have, but I just forgot about it. Alright, Estelle. That's real good. You know what, for Joshua, I'm gonna save it for one turn. I wanna see if he's gonna... You know, if we might need it for an emergency. Alright, here we go. They have pillars. That's a lot of them. Can we... at least... deal a ton of damage? Maybe I should've saved all of my... especially Reese. And Kevin's S crap before. I mean, I should have waited for her. This guy to summon the pillars. Darn. Darn. Should I just repeat the battle? Maybe I should just repeat it, right? Hmm. It's, it's such a waste, but at least the damage is directly dealt to the. The, the boss because right now you know he he blocked He's, he has a barrier on I'm assuming I destroyed the pillar so I, you know before I can touch him again all right let's focus on the target and the pillar that is southernmost this guy right here. Can I delay a pillar? Guess not. Let's 
guess I can't hit multiple targets with that. Alright, that pillar is down. Okay. Uh oh, what's this Sep Crisis thing? This is not so friendly. That is crazy strong. Damn. Wow. Alright, so... I'm gonna guess that's all that... They're gonna do. And I need to heal ASAP. I think Kevin can heal... Hopefully everyone, but... I'm gonna focus on kicking ass. I think I get an oh what? That's so weak, what the hell happened? You see the damage? It was just five hundred. What happened to you, Estelle? Increase do you have a healing thing? Don't, huh? Alright, let's see how you deal damage to three pillars. Okay, not bad. If I don't have a group heal, then I'm gonna use items during the next set of turns. I wonder why Stealth's attack was so weak. I don't see any status ailment. Unless her weapon... Her weapon strength is affected by... Uh, the... The HP. Not screw it. Heal yourself. Hmm. I can actually use this. It's interesting. Let's do that. This will protect me, right? From one attack. Let's try that out. Then Estelle, since she's weak, she'll be healing every turn. One by one. Right. That will be our strategy for now. Let's two pillars down. Okay, I can't use that skill, so let's just attack normally. Kevin. You need to charge up your CP so I can do it again next time around. So I should block this with Kevin's Holy Grail. Holy S Grail Sphere, whatever it's called. Alright. Okay, so what we're gonna do is use this on Kevin. Wait, do I have any other CP item? I don't think I do, right? That's the only one. Mm -hmm. Yep. I'll use this on Kevin so we can cast Holy Grail, Sphere, whatever again. Excellent. Whack this dude, this pillar. <laughs> Just one. Fine. Wait. Yeah, I have a strength up, so let's take advantage. There you go.
Okay, so it's gonna start casting. We'll use Grail Sphere. That's the name, Grail Sphere. I skipped it last time, so let's watch it this time around. Estelle, you continue your healing shenanigans. This time you heal Reese. Okay, Joshua, start whacking at this next pillar, the flame pillar. I don't care about your elements, I'm gonna attack you physically. That was good damage. Okay, here it comes again. You should be fine. I'm gonna use the same strategy. I'm gonna use another Zerum powder. So we can do that Grail Sphere attack against Grail Sphere skill. I should say again. Can you finish it off, Kevin? Hopefully. Oh, it's okay. Joshua to the rescue. Same strategy. kind of a waste, but it's the final battle. There's no such thing as waste. Let's go clockwise. I'm gonna place her in here, actually, so that I can maximize my space. There you go. And heal Joshua, please. Joshua, you're quite far away, but I think you, yep, you're able to reach it. One more. I'm gonna guess you need to use one more. What? Holy crap, I wasn't able to have a turn with. Kevin to block the attack. Crapiola. Wow. Alright, that's a shock. Good thing we survived. Hmm. Wake up Joshua. Damn, my positioning. It got nullified. It's okay, we got this. Now we use that Grail Sphere. Can't believe I did not. You know what? I'm very close to a 200 CP. There you go. So it means I can block two attacks. But based on the description, I don't think it will lie, right? Two pillars left. Aww. For real this time. Alright. Here we go. Two attacks. Should be good, I think, for the rest of the fight. You give this to Reese. Then we finally get to use Infinity Sparrows. Go. Wow, I didn't realize Estelle was able, you know, is able to go to 200 CP already.
Okay, Joshua. Let's go to number five, I think, right? No, the sixth pillar. This is actually this is weaker, so let's focus on this one. I don't know if it really matters, but whatever. Oh. Okay, Kevin. Another Infinity Sparrow, please, to finish off that other pillar. Then there was one. I assume the damage will be weaker the more pillars you destroy, but that one time where the attack went through was actually very strong, surprisingly. Stronger than I expected it to be. Alright. Alright, Kevin. Whack away. Let's give it a double strike, please. Holy crap, it's almost ready, but... Wait, where is it? Yes, you can do this, Reese. <gasps> oh no! It's an accident. Can I, can't I cancel? Damn it, I wasted the 200 CP. At least I prevented the critical, right? I guess it was the correct decision, because I don't have the, the barrier anymore for my crew. And now it has mobs again, what's that? Hopefully Kevin, he can... I'm gonna charge up with Kevin. Joshua, I'll start cleaning up. Oh man, I'm not immune. My bad. Let's help out. Estelle will cure later. Let's just use this one. Okay, the good thing is it has a very short range. Still though. Can't believe Joshua's not immune to that faint status. Oh man, this is gonna suck. It can handle whatever that's gonna be. Alright, I'm not gonna risk it. Joshua will leave by attacking this guy here. You should leave too, Reese, so Estelle is gonna be the only one left in the danger zone. That's crazy strong. And it missed. Good freaking job, Estelle. You rock. I mean, I knew that about you, but still, it's nice to see. We're good to go. Okay, we're, we're doing okay so far. Though he has a lot of HP. 
Oh man, the two bright folks they don't have protection. Because they have to use this. Alright, let's charge up to at least 100 CP. Because we're close. Well, at least for the Bright Sisters and Kevin. Bright Siblings, I should say. Hopefully this Kevin doesn't get to play healer all the time. Whoa. Alright, we're gonna have to eat it. And everyone's frozen. Darn it. Kevin, save the day, please. Thank you for saving us. Alright. Hmm. I think I have a group cure, right? I don't know what the item is called. The SS? No. Really, I don't? Hmm, I thought I had a, a group cure item. Guess not. Wait. Yeah, I guess not. Oops. I accidentally picked, well, pressed the wrong button. Well, I want that strength up, so Joshua, do the honors, please. Defense up. As well, I guess. I have to use spells. I thought it said summon friend, but I guess it's a fiend. Which makes sense. Man, it's gonna do the same thing again. Can I impede him? We'll try. Yes, good job. That was a nasty attack. Alright, Kevin, save the day again. At least they walk so tiny. Oh, well, that sucks. They just made z a still vanish. You get to play healer again. I know it's strength down, but we have to get rid of those fiends. Oh man, that sucks. We're just halfway through, this will be a long freaking fight. I'll 
When will the defense up of the, on the big guy disappear? I can't believe I'm not immune to faints. It's really messing up my my game plan. Oh my goodness! I think we're gonna lose. All right, this does back. She gonna survive? Okay, she did, thankfully. But she's freaking frozen. I think we just. My goodness. Is there a way we can change our equipment? Alright, take two. Man, this is tougher than I anticipated. The saddest elements are really killing us, though. And we have to get rid of the fiends immediately because they... They wreck us with those... Um, those... what you call it? They wreck us with the vanishing act that they do. Let's try to fast track this. By using some Zerum capsule. I'm lazy. You can eat the first one. That shouldn't be a problem. Okay. What? How come? Is it an elemental attack? How come only one pillar got damaged? I don't understand that. Damn, that was a waste. I'm gonna fast track, sorry guys. Hopefully, this will not backfire. I wasted that serum capsule. You know what, I'm not gonna use any skills here. I'm gonna save up for the big guy. Uh, except for the barrier thing, but the rest we're just gonna attack normally. Cast your thing, please. Hurry up. Wait, it hasn't casted it. Casted yet, right? It hasn't. Okay. I'd, I'd be dead if it has. There you go. Alright, Kevin. Grail Sphere. Then the cell will start the healing process. Start with Kevin.
Maybe I shouldn't have used Kevin. Started with Kevin because I'm gonna use an item later on. Oh well. It was a wrong decision. Yeah, it was a stupid decision to heal Kevin because I'm gonna use a Zerum item on him. Alright, halfway through. Here's our Zerum powder. We're good to go. Oh, sorry. Yeah, back to curing. Cure yourself, Estelle. I think I might use two more Zerum powders, fortunately. Still have a few. If I only have faint protection, victory is all but guaranteed, but I didn't know that I needed that. Gonna need one more Zerum powder. <laughs> or do I? Maybe I don't actually. How much HP do you have? We're gonna go for it. Joshua should be able to finish that off. Alright. Good. Alright, here we go again.
I want a critical hit. Go for it, Joshua. Eliminate the two pests. I'm gonna save that for when he summons minions again. However, for this one, I'm gonna use it right now. Whoa, what is that? We better impede that. I'm scared of that attack. Yes, everything is weak, but come on. Oh, come on! What is this? It's an outer space attack. I did not have a chance to react to that attack, so hopefully it's not an instant kill. So that would be unfair. That's a bunch of BS, man. An instant kill attack? What the hell is that? Alright folks, looks like we're not gonna beat it this episode. But I learned I need to have Holy Grail or Grail Sphere ready at all times. See you next time in hopefully the final episode of Trails in the Sky, the third.